Mello is money. The following contest is a triple threat match. And it's for the Hardcore Championship. Introducing the challenger from Boston, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 210 pounds, Carmelo Hayes. I hate to pair it a catchphrase, but Mello really is money. Multiple title reigns and main events to his name already. And this guy is destined to continue that success in all of WWE. Time for Mello to make that money. Well, Mustafa Ali promises you will not forget his name. And introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 182 pounds, Mustafa Ali. A man who has become virtually obsessed with not allowing himself to be mislabeled anymore. Major chip on his shoulder. Oftentimes, Mustafa Ali shows he's got more guts than brains, but he is all heart. Well, Ali has faced a lot of adversity in his career, but the one thing we've learned is that Mustafa Ali never stops fighting. Skilled, but also very arrogant. And introducing the champion from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds. He is the hardcore champion, Austin Theory. All the potential in the world, but unfortunately, a bad attitude, too. The youngest Money in the Bank winner and also the youngest superstar to fail cashing in his Money in the Bank contract. Ah, oh, shut up, Saxton. Money in the Bank was an anchor, an albatross, and Austin Theory is better having gotten rid of it. presentation for what's considered one of the most unruly titles in this entire business. Hope you're ready for a fun one. The Hardcore Championship is on the line in this triple threat match with Carmelo Hayes, Mustafa Ali, and Austin Theory. You always have to keep your head on a swivel in a triple threat match, but when a title's on the line, you really need to be on your game. Champion's advantage flies right out the window here. That is absolutely right, Corey. In a match like this, the champion does not even need to be part of the deciding fall for the match to be over and a new champ to be crowned. Everything can come down to a matter of seconds. Neckbreaker! Sound the alarm! To win a triple threat match, you must be opportunistic. 
If you can play your opponents against each other, then you can sit back, bide your time, and steal the win when they've beaten each other down. I like the sound of that strategy. We'll see if any of these superstars take that path in this match. It's incredible, the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Ouch. <laughs> That's that self-entitled confidence from Theory. There's a slingshot into the drop kick. the submission. Oh, and Theory fights back. From behind. Back suplex. Going for a pin for the championship. Only a one count before the kick out. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough. The challenger eating up some damage. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Beautiful takedown into the Achilles lock. Oh, Lee's got something to prove. All oh, the pressure on the left knee. He's trying to fight it. He's trying to break out and does it. Basement drop kick. Boom. Drop kick. Surprise. Oh no. And a reverse DDT. Austin Theory hoisting him up. Great buster to the knee. Took him out at the knee. Prime example of working smarter, not harder. That's what I say. Oh, right to the kidneys. God, please. He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. In a corner. The champ's shoulders are down. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive.